Hey everybody, welcome back to Fawin Channel. Um, as you guys might remember, I uh, already played Octodad all the way through, and I had discovered that there were a couple other little short games that you can play of it, and we already had that terrible first date, Dad Romance, and today we're gonna do Medical Mess, which is, I am assuming, um, I'm a doctor or a nurse, or an Octo Doctor. An Oc doc if you will. Wait, Doc Oc? That's whatever. Anyways, let's go ahead and just jump into it today and uh, see what's up. Okay. Um, Tommy? What? What's this story about? Wait Dad, a minute. This is a story about Dad. <laughs> what? what? He's in a wrestling ring. Woo! Bring it! You smell what the calamari's cooking. I think he's at the hospital. What? And he's a nurse. Whoa. Uh, that's lame. Why can't he be a doctor? No, he's a nurse and he does nursey things. <laughs> I do nursey things. Fine. So okay. So he goes to the nurse station. So... <laughs> I have a... <laughs> so this isn't that my actual job. This is my kids telling a story about me? What do I... I wonder what I actually do. Oh, man. Um, somehow I lost the use of my other fin. Maybe it was always this one. I don't remember. Uh, although that this is coming in order to you guys, it's actually been a while since I've recorded Octodad. Uh, I know that FTL came out first, but... I actually first recorded Octodad and then a bunch of other stuff. Came back to it, recorded more. This was just like my go-to to come back to. My uh, my palate cleanser, if you will. So let's see what we do. Go to the nurse's station. So let's head on over with our scrubby scrub. Whoa. The nautical mile. Okay. Excuse me. Don't worry, guys in the waiting room. I'm a professional. This is the nurse's station, right? I think so. Oh, I hope I don't have to operate on anybody. <laughs> um, oops. Oops. Uh, I'm here. I clocked in. Ha! Oh, shoot. Uh, find the patient records. Uh, is it in here? Oop. Oop. Nurse Dad had to go help all the patients. Okay. Help your patient. So two oh five. Let's head over two oh five. What, what's what is this? This is two oh five. All right. Hey, buddy. I'm Dad, just here checking out. Guy who was a jerk. Oh, you're well, jerking. About time. My what? bottom hurts. Adjust my bed, nurse. Uh oh man. I can already see this gonna end bad. Um, how does one adjust your bed? Uh, how do I go? There we go. That looks more like that's your IV. How do I... How do I adjust your bed? Is it... Let's steal your food. <laughs> nope. Nope. How do I adjust the bed? Is it... The only thing of the bed that I can interact with is this guy. These melon slices aren't just gonna jump into my mouth. Oh, yeah, you know what? You're right. They are not. Instead, they're gonna be stuffed in there. Nah. Okay. Uh, feed three melons. Th well, that I guess was four. How do I? Do I? Do I still need to use a fork? Oh, I forgot how frustrating this game can be right now. Okay. Um. Abandon the fork. We're just gonna... Boom. Mm. Yeah, there you go. It's a melon. You don't need a fork. Are you an animal? I just lost the fork. Oh, no, no. Oh, everything is terrible. Everything is terrible right now. I need the fork. Fork, please. Fork. There's the fork. I found the fork! No, no, no. No. Oh, oh, yes, all right. All right, all right, all right. 
Got the fork. Got the metal. Eat it. Uh, eat it. Eat up, Johnny. Patient 205, who will henceforth be known as Johnny Jackass. Mm. Uh, mm. Fed to you in your ear, buddy. Give me a book. How about the nautical mile? I'm gonna go get you the nautical mile. You know why? Because that sounds boring as shit. Wait. I came in over here. Ah. Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh no. Open. Qua. Get you the nautical mile. The, uh, uh, what? What is going on with my foot? Uh, yeah, gotcha. I am dead set on giving you the most boring book I can find. You know how you can tell? If you're an adult and you have a boring book, it actually has titles on it. If it's just leather bound with no titles, it's gotta be interesting, right? Something's gotta make you come to those books. My IV was Bam. slow. Change it already. Uh Okay. I'm gonna just take this guy. And we're gonna go over here. Do you think it'd be at the nurse's station? I mean, I'm no... Oh, wait. That must be my mug. It's the number one dad over there. Let's go see. Yep. Yeah. I'm a nurse. I need that coffee. Alright, so... If I was in a hospital, which I'm not. I've never worked at a hospital. And I need a fresh IV... Blooper pole, <laughs> or blooping pole? Oh wait, oh I just need the I just need the one. Uh, here's your blooping pole. Oh my gosh, I am the worst orderly ever. Here, this doesn't count, I guess. Okay, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna murder this guy. He's probably in here for like something dumb, like he has a a kennel cough or something like that. Oh, sorry. Uh, don't don't put me down for sexual harassment. That was a total accident. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Oh, wait. She might need that blooper Paul. So I better not steal somebody else's blooper Paul. Blooping Paul, whatever it's called. Um. Hey, Steve. What are you just doing? Just stared at me. Where do I get the the new IVs? I'm new. It's my first day. Excuse me. Uh, if you're a nurse or a doctor, oh, I was about to say, if you're a nurse or a doctor and you know where this kind of stuff usually is in a hospital, let me know, but I just found it. Oop. Ah, got it. <laughs> Whoops. Now get out of here. I'm sick of your face. Psh. I'm going to smack you in the face. Psh, psh, psh. Hey, your face. I'm out. Okay, so I got three more patients. Who's in, uh... She looks like she could be helped, like, right now. Why is... Why is my tentacle stuck? Okay. Oh, okay, I need a second. Okay, this way. Oh my gosh. Hi! And then Dad met the patient who was sad and weird. <laughs> it's bad, isn't it? Oh no! Oh no, is it Chaz? Leforia? The Macarena? You better check my blood pressure. What? What? Okay, so <laughs> we have the jerk. Oh, we're gonna do all the all the patient tropes. We got the jerk, and this is gonna be the hypochondriac. Gonna get your blood pressure. Oop! Sorry, I didn't mean to grab your ass. Sorry, I'm trying. To, I'm really trying not to grab your ass. Oh, 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 oh! It's glowing for me. I know. At least this one's telling me where the stuff is. Got it. Look into the light. Walk into the light. Oh no, I'm gonna die. Haha. Am I blinking enough? I feel like I'm not blinking enough. Right. What is it? Oh, give it to me straight, nurse. Very accurate medical terms. Oh, okay. Uh, can you show me on the whiteboard? Hey, job. Oh, I see. I have unicornitis. Unicornitis. What? The bagel beds. Ma'am, I'm afraid it's something serious. It's unicornitis. Thanks, nurse. Away. Whoa. People afflicted with unicornitis can fly. I want that. 
Whoa, what happened? Oh, everything was saving and just like froze the game for a second. I want a Unicorn I got a horn, I can just slam onto people. I guess I can't go in there. I can uh, fly, I mean that's all I want, I just want to fly. Oh. And Dad met this one lady who was really nice. Yay! Good morning, Mr. Nurse. Hello. If it's not too much trouble, would you mind fluffing my pillow and turning off the television? Sure. You see people out there, if you're a jerk, no one's going to want to help you. If you're too needy, no one's going to want to help you. But if you're cool like this chick is here, then we'll, do, we'll go out of our way to help you. There we go. No more TV for you. Fluff the patient's pillow. Where is the pillow? Do you s what? Did you throw the pillow? Were you trying to get my attention and you threw the pillow at me? Is that what's up? Where is your pillow? <laughs> um. Uh, oh, oh, it fell back here. Okay. Fluff, 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 fluff. Oh. Fluff, not pillow fight. Oh, sorry. Could you fetch me some donuts from the waiting room, please? Oh, hell yeah. Here's some money to buy them. Ooh. All right, cool. I'm not sure if it's a good thing, as a medical practitioner, to give your patients donuts. I don't know, maybe she has, like, hyperglycanol. -gly What's that? What's hyperglycemic? Is that it? Or is that when you have too much sugar? I am not a doctor. That's for micro. Sorry. And, um... Donuts? Donuts. Do oh, it's gonna do that to me. <laughs> it got stuck! Give me the donuts! Give me the donuts! Give me my donuts! Oh, give me the donuts! Let me have the donuts! Oh my gosh. I'm gonna give her an empty bag. I can already see it happening. Oh no, no, no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh, I think I gotta clear it. Okay, hold on. I think I just gotta hit all the buttons. Okay, now it makes room for the donuts. So. Get your wrestling chips. Get up, Jack! Okay. Ugh. Just want the donuts. I wish donuts like that came out of machines. They're usually like super tiny. Gotcha. Yeah. Oh man. <laughs> I want the donuts. <laughs> Come on. There we go. My donuts. My donuts. Ugh, I hope you like. They look like chocolate donuts that have like white. Um, frosting on or something. That actually might be good. Here you go, ma'am. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Uh, what now? He helped all the people. Now I get to go home. Oh, the phone rings. <sighs> okay. No one likes answering the phones at work. Nobody does. I don't care what your job is. Your job might be to answer phones. <laughs> you don't want to answer the phone. And on the phone is Dad's long lost brother. Mike? Dad, it's your long lost brother. I've got terrible news for you. What is it? Your patient is going into cardiac arrest. How do you know that? Patient alert in room 204. Oh, it's the jerk guy, too. Oh. Oh. Come with me if you want to live. To the emergency room with you. I really hope nobody else is seeing this right now. This is the, the this is the emergency room, right? Right? Oh, I have to put you on the gurney. Uh, you know, like a actual professional health professional. Oops. Um, where's the gurney? Oh, is this it? I thought it was just your bed. There we go. It doubles as a gurney. What the hell is going on? I don't know. It's one of those hospital things they say on TV. <laughs> Totally is. Arrest, arrest. I gotcha. I gotcha. You're sweet. All right. So get him to the prep room. Let's go. Wee woo wee woo wee woo wee woo wee woo. Get on. I am the nurse attending. 
fearsome Whoa. challenge. Whoa! You're a nurse too. Why aren't you helping me? Good thing there was a crowbar there. A what? What? What is going on? <laughs> what is going on? Um. Yeah. Open door. Open door. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. This is not how a pry bar works. Ugh. Okay. To the prep room with you. That's recovery. This is this is it, right? Ah, oh, this is probably the prep room. Okay. It, says, it actually says prep room, but I don't, you're gonna end up here anyways. Stay here. Don't go anywhere while you're in cardiac arrest. While I find out where the prep room is. Oh my gosh. Um, is it prep room? Yes, it is. I guess I have to actually take him through those doors. Johnny jerks a lot. Let's go. Oh my god. He's here. Okay. Um, wash your hands. Don't touch me, I'm sterile! <laughs> Give him anesthesia. Right in the butt! Get him on the OR table. Gotcha. Come on, Johnny Jerks. Yeah, I don't think the human body is meant to contort that way, but that's why he's here. He's on the table. He's on the table. Why does it not count? Good enough. <laughs> page Dr. Nigel. 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 Oh, the, the page thing is over there. I'm pretty sure this is it. Um... Paging Dr. Nigel. Paging Dr. Herman. You have pressed all the buttons. Good! Please try again. <laughs> Hello? Who is it? Joe? Stop calling me. Get out your ass over here. I have a Well, I think I made it worse, but get over here. Paging Dr. Nigel. Dr. Nigel to the operating room. Yeah, thank you. Gosh. Okay, wait for Dr. Nigel. Da -da -da -da! And he was famous. His name was Nigel. X rays the patient. Okay. Doctor. Give it to him straight. Is there any chance to save this man? X ray and the patient. Oh, there's an on button. <laughs> I'm just like slamming. <laughs> Oh, I would be the worst doctor or nurse. I'm just like dragging through the hallway, bending his back the wrong way, just slamming an x-ray machine all over him. Yes, all the x-ray goodness. I am x-ray the patient, aren't I? Yes, x-ray the crotch. What's wrong with this crotch? Does he have crotchitis? The scalpel, okay. I'll turn this off so I don't give everyone counts. Ah! Pull you out of the way. Uh, no, we don't want to use that. Um, scalpel. Uh, that's a screwdriver. That's a fork. That's a mallet. That's a. I don't know what the hell that is. Um, is it, is it in the prep room? Do they think a screwdriver is a scalpel? Ah, then I give them the screwdriver. No. <laughs> He's like, what, is this your first time? Yes, it's my first day! I don't know what I'm doing. Before this, I was a waiter. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Scalpel! <laughs> now, ladies and gentlemen, if you have a scalpel, don't do what I'm doing, and that's flopping all around the place where someone can easily get hurt. Here. There you go. Yes. Uh, a bone saw. What is go? Is it because I broke his back like 80 times? What's up? Back to the prep room. Where does Dad find a bone saw? I don't know. In a box somewhere. In a box filled with 
use hypodermic needles. Yeah, this is sanitary. You gotta die. And Dad got all up in some guts. I don't know, Stacy. Dad grounded me for a week after my last story. Whoa. Fort Johnson and the zombie hurricane <laughs> was pretty violent. It was my masterpiece. Okay. Oh, so it turned out the man was a robot all along. That's what the screwdriver's for. What is love? What is love? So now the surgery can Whoa. Begin. Oh, this is like that one game where you're the doctor, or, or you're uh, a surgeon, and all you have is like one arm. Okay, and Nigel, a tool. Doctor. Open the chest plate. Oh, wow, this is kind of cool, actually. <laughs> Clear the chest cavity. Uh, you don't need this. You don't need this. Uh, you don't need this. I guess you don't need everything, huh? I don't know what all these capacitors and gears and stuff are for, but... Don't die on me, Mr. Robot! I'll have to reboot you. Okay, um, clear the chest cavity. Oh, there's one more thing. That should be everything, right? Wipe Nigel's forehead. Oh, so this is the gauze. And in his chest they find the broken heart. <laughs> okay, my daughter's adorable. What can I say? Oh. oh my god! What the hell is going on? Catch the heart. Oh, I can move now? Oh, I think it went that way. Oh my gosh. Ah, gotcha. Give the heart to Nigel. What the? I like that it's not blood, because that would be too gory if kids were playing this game, but it's like oil or something. Because he's a robot. He's a robot! For the robots! Everywhere! Whew. Reattach the, lo the robot limbs. Okay, so we got... Ugh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, come on! Ugh. That one. Oh, that's the leg? What happened to his arm? That's... Oh, his arm is running away! His arm is getting... Did everybody else see that? It was like scooting away. Oh, uh, no. Uh, is it this side? Awesome! Um... Oh, no. So, does this mean I'm not necessarily a nurse and doctor, but like a mechanic and their assistant or something? That's actually some cool robot <laughs> sounds. Oh, where is where is anything anymore? Um, I'd love to stop right here, but I feel like we're almost done. We're just gonna keep going a little bit. If there's if we have to do anything else after the robot, I'll, I'll just stop it here. We might have like an extra short episode or something. Um, where did the where did the other limb go? Oh! Oh, I saw it! It's behind the x-ray machine! Gotcha! Gotcha, you had for me, huh? Okay. Oh, he's booting up. He's not a robot anymore. <laughs> what the? What is anything anymore? Oh, oh, I got defibrillates! Jerk Johnson over here. John Jerkson. Right in the face. Maybe I can shock some sense into you for being a dick. Again. Whew. I actually know how to do this in real life, too. It's kind of cool. Well, I know how to do an auto one. <laughs> I am totally high-fiving you, Nigel. We did some good robot doctrine today. <laughs> Up high! Ugh. Oh, I hit it. That's bullshit. I totally hit it. Mmm! Mmm! Why did it be so hard? Okay, let's back up. Back up. Pachow! Oh, God. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh! Oh! <laughs> Just want to give this man a high five! Ooh. 
Oh, I am so tense right now. Oh my god. Mm. 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 Uh, this is going to be a 30 minute video of me just trying to get a high five to a person as a thing. So, uh, can we just hug it out? Here we go. Oh my god. Low five. Too slow? Too slow? Are you going to too slow this thing? You're going to too slow? Let's, let's back up. No. Uh, more than once. Fist bump. Uh, oh, the, his. F <laughs> okay. His fist is like super tiny. Maybe that's why he's a doctor. This is so hard. Put the patient in the wheelchair. Oh, I'll put him in a wheelchair. All right. After I throw him in all these needles. Take that. Put you back in the emergency room for being a jerk. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. Wait, what? That is actually a pretty sexy picture of itself. Okay. In you go. In you go. And Dad brought the not a robot anymore patients back to his room safely. Okay, this should be it, I think. Oh. Um. Uh. Um. Gotcha. Alright, let's go. Whoop. Go to your room, Jerk Jerkinson. Johnny Jerk song. Flop him around, flop it around. Whoop. Yeah, this has got to be almost be over. Ugh. Okay then. You're in your room. But uh, but Dad caught unicornitis from that alien lady. Oh and man. The only cure for unicornitis is. Jet skis? So he bought us some sweet jet skis! The end. Wow, that was a lot shorter than the, uh... Well, I guess it was about the same time as the dad romance one. I don't remember. Didn't the dad romance one last like, last, like, 30 minutes or something? Or, like, I don't know. I remember dad romance being longer. Maybe it just felt longer. I don't know. I don't know what the hell is going on here. But that's gonna be basically it for uh, Octodad. That's everything. Um, all in all, I think I like the main story better than these shorts. These shorts were kind of like, oh, here's some extra stuff to do, I guess. But I think it was kind of cool to actually see what 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 you could do in like different areas, like being a doctor, or being a waiter, and stuff like that as an octopus. I think it would have been cooler if. Uh, because I guess in the original one, or um, the actual story one, you got to also be like a boat captain and stuff, like a grocery shop. But being that's Octodad, I was hoping to see like more dad stuff, like playing baseball with your kid, or teaching the daughter how to ride a bike and just make it like super silly or something like that. But I mean, you know, dads have jobs and dads gotta get that romance with the mom and all that other stuff. But I think it would be cool if they have more. I guess that's really my only complaint about this game is I, I just wish there was more. But what what we, what we got is still fun. Um, thanks again for watching, everybody. If you want more videos, more content, just uh, hit that subscribe button. Um, post a comment on what you thought of Octodad or with me flopping through Octodad. And uh, stay tuned for some more videos. Uh, give me a like, comment, subscribe. See you guys next time. Take care, everybody.